Happening today, the Brevard County School Board is expected to officially announce its selection for superintendent. It comes amid a wave of changes, including the ousting of the interim superintendent last month. News 6's Mark Lehman joins us live from Brevard School Board headquarters this morning. And there are three finalists in the running now, Mark. One dropped out last week, but three finalists remain for the school board to choose from. It's a big decision for Brevard Public Schools, and this after what some have called a leadership crisis here at the district. After several months of changes and uncertainty, the Brevard County School Board is expected to choose a superintendent once again. I hope this board chooses somebody that reflects the community. The field has been narrowed down to three finalists. Scott Schneider, an administrator from Duval County, Dr. Mark Rendell, principal at Cocoa Beach Junior Senior High, and Dr. Jason Wysong, the deputy superintendent in Seminole County. This was a very well-qualified group of, of candidates. A fourth finalist, Hernando Superintendent John Stratton, withdrew a week ago after outcry over his recent handling of a teacher who allegedly made a threatening comment about students. Brevard County needs a new leader after the forced resignation of Dr. Mark Mullins in December. A few months later, the district also parted ways with interim superintendent Dr. Robert Schiller. At the time, he blasted the school board for what he called an absurd timeline for the superintendent search. Board members also said there were complaints about a hostile work environment that let them, led them to placing the interim superintendent on leave. Now the focus turns to the vote on the next superintendent. Discussion begins at 9 this morning. For now, reporting live in Brevard County, Mark Lehman, getting results, News 6.